In the world of information technology, carnivore is not a flesh-eating animal. It is a controversial program developed by the U.S. Federal Bureau of Investigation, FBI, that gives them access to the online activities of criminals. Carnivore is the name given to an electronic surveillance software mechanism that has been conceived and is implemented by the Federal Bureau of Investigation of the United States of America. In short, it is a program that allows the FBI to sniff out important packets that travel over the internet on the basis of emails to really target at suspected information. A third generation online detection software, a carnivore, is a package sniffer technology that has been existing for some time. Computer network administrators use packet sniffers to monitor networks, diagnose tests and troubleshoot problems. A packet sniffer can be set up through filtered and unfiltered processes. Packets with target data are copied and stored in the memory or on a hard drive as they pass through networks. The stored copies are later analyzed for specific information or patterns. Carnivore has basically been seen to be used for various kinds of cybercrime cases, which include uh, usage of internet for terrorist activities, which includes uh, usage for hacking and other highly surveillance uh, subjects. It also has been used for tracking down important emails of suspected cyber criminals, which have been suspected of bigger cyber crimes. A carnivore requires warrants specifying the suspect, what lines it will tap, what kind of information it will see. A federal district judge or a higher authority can only issue a warrant for the contents of your email. For normal search warrants, any judge can authorize it. The FBI that plans to use carnivore for specific reasons requires a court order to track down persons suspected of terrorism, child pornography, exploitation, espionage, information warfare and fraud. However, carnivore can only be used in certain specific circumstances and under the guidance and supervision of the court at large. It has also been held to be not violative of individuals' right of privacy because the courts have held that the uh, basic interests of a nation to preserving security and peace have to be balanced with the individual's rights of privacy at large. And individuals cannot claim an absolute right of privacy to the exception or to the exclusion of uh, the state's right of preserving you know, peace and interest as a whole. Though a carnivore helps cleansing the society of bad elements, issues related to its use have led to serious questions. A carnivore can be usually used under the guidelines of the Electronic Communications Privacy Act. The Act provides legal protection of privacy for all types of electronic communication. Many a time, this Act is flouted. By way of screening unscrupulous matters, the agency might go through the personal text of suspects. Many feel this violates the constitutional right to the freedom of speech. We need to have an electronic surveillance system that could help the law enforcement agencies to knock down criminals, to nab them and also to ensure that cybercrime does not proliferate as a large on the Indian subcontinent. However, what role that would be, in what uh, you know, shape it will come across, one doesn't exactly know. Because carnivore, by and large, is an FBI pro property. While taking into various considerations, implementing carnivore has become a difficult task for the FBI. With the agency's refusal to disclose source code and technical information about carnivore, the technology has come under severe criticism by the surfers. As long as it is used within the constraints and guidelines of ECPA, carnivore has the potential to become a useful weapon in the war against the world of crime in cyberspace. <laughs>